good morning. Will this finally be the vlog that I get done from start to finish? I don't know. We're about to see. I don't think I have vlogged since last year. It is now January of 2023. It's been a very long time, but hopefully I'll get this one done because God knows I've tried countless times. There is weeks worth of footage on this camera that I just, I never lay down and edit. I just, I don't know. Right now though, I am going to brush my teeth, wash my face, and get dressed in a cute little pajama outfit. I'm gonna go to a coffee shop and get some work done. Um, I'm styling it around these sweatpants. They're my favorite from Brandy Melville. Just put on a little cardigan and I'll throw on a jacket. I'll be ready to go. It's the middle of January um, in New York City and it has not snowed. It's been in the 50s for most of January. It's the most mild winter ever. And again, coming from Los Angeles, I want the weather. I want the season, so a little disappointing, but I'll see you soon. I got this new electric toothbrush and I really like it. It makes me brush my teeth for less time than I usually would. Usually I go crazy and I'll brush my teeth for like 10 minutes. It's really bad, I should talk to the dentist about it. But this kind of forces me to stick to like a hot four, I would say. So I'm just about ready to go to the coffee shop to get some work done, but I thought I would update you on what I need to do before we go. So in the new year, I picked up my five minute journal again. I did this very sporadically last year, did not do it good enough. Um, and I'm, I'm trying to be a little better, but it's already been sporadic. It's already, it's only been a few days in January that I've done it, but it's something, it's better than nothing. And I really like it. It gives you some good prompts and it gives you like a quote or like a challenge for the day. It's like something easy, like smile at someone or meditate or whatever. Um, and I just think this is good because sometimes you don't feel like you have anything to be grateful for. Um, so it kind of forces you to put something down. So I really like this and drinking water. Those are, those are the big things. This little, oh Jesus Christ. Did y'all see that? This is not a very good cup, but I already drank this much and that is so much better than all of last year. I'm literally wearing the weirdest outfit ever. I'm wearing this brown leather jacket with gray sweatpants and a little cardigan. I just, I want it to feel like cute, but comfy. Um, I'm not sure if this is a cute, comfy outfit, but I'm wearing it anyway. It might look like I escaped out of a hospital and stole like a worker's jacket and put it over, but I don't know. this can in the morning I'm not a big coffee person and there's a good amount of caffeine in this but it's like healthy for you supposedly question mark I like it it's it's got an interesting taste it's not like a soda it's like somewhere in between like a sparkling water and a flavored soda I don't know um got my Harry Potter water drinking cup I need to drink water I know I'm not the only person who doesn't like to drink water that's been sitting out overnight and this one has been but there's no bugs in it so i think it's good enough to drink i need to shower and i don't know if i'm the only person who's like this but i cannot shower in the daytime like it grosses me out to my core i don't know how to explain it i think it's a sensory thing i just feel like dirty when i shower in the daytime when i get out i feel gross i just feel overwhelmed it's like a sensory overload thing but can't do it so when it when the sun sets i'll pop in the shower which will be which will be nice maybe i'll go all out and have like a relaxing shower like i'll put on pretty lights and like light candles but most likely i won't most likely oh god the construction is so loud most likely i'll just have a 
boring shower because I'll be too lazy to do all that stuff. Okay, I love my little workout outfit today, but I need a sports bra next time because this thing, this thing ain't supportive enough for me. Um, but it was fine for a at home workout. Okay, excuse my very loud robot vacuum, but currently I am reorganizing my little jewelry area. It was just a wreck. It was like piled and I need to rehaul it a bit. Oh my gosh, guys, a special surprise for the vlog. This is like the first time it snowed this hard all year. Oh, snow is my favorite ever, so I'm very, very happy about this. Okay, currently I'm going through my little makeup section. I thought I'd show you guys really quick. So I keep like all my blushes, highlighters, bronzers above. It's like all the eye stuff. I try to keep this organized, but it's just like impossible. The storage is just too small for how much makeup I have. And then this is all lip products and these are like stacked. So there's like more <laughs> sections underneath of um, lip products. There's so many, it's crazy. And I, I do clear outs like with my little sisters, like literally monthly. This is just like a little storage drawer where I put like extras, unopened products, stuff like that. And then, this is like face products, all like base makeup. The bottom drawer is all palettes and extra eye makeup. Guys, is this like one of those 2008 um, like makeup storage room videos? I used to love those. I keep my everyday makeup that I use in this little case and that's kind of like, I can like carry it around the house and it makes it easier for me to have all my like everyday products in here. So currently I am sending my grandma a little goodie bag of PR basically that I have like duplicates of that I really like and want her to try out. So I have this little say package and I'm sending the Glowy Super Gel. This is so good. It can be used under your foundation, mixed foundation, just really good. And then um, their Hydro Beam Concealer. This is really good, super moisturizing. I have a bunch. And then the slip tint, which is, this is like holy grail. This is so good, the slip tint. So I thought she should have one. And then Caudalie, the uh, rich cream. I have one of these already and it's so good. And I thought that she would really like this. So I'm gonna pop this in as well. And I'm gonna continue building throughout the week. I think I have some other items in mind that I wanna put in here. Also guys, how cute is this? I got an invite to um, a Paco Rabanne party this morning and they hand delivered these beautiful flowers. Thank you Paco Rabanne, I'm so excited. Hi guys, okay this is the weirdest lighting ever. I am currently doing my makeup to go to a brand event tonight. Um, it's gonna be really fun, it's at a bowling alley. I've never been to a brand event at a bowling alley, we'll see. I texted my friend who's gonna be there, I was like, are you gonna bowl tonight? And she let me know that she was in a middle school bowling club. So I'm kind of scared. Um, I just got out of the shower and as you can see from this weird hair situation going on, I'm trying a new air dry thing um, because I, I wanna stop heat styling my hair. I, I never used to heat style my hair and then like the last couple months I've been getting into it and I, I have to find uh, a non heat day routine. So we'll see. I'm currently almost done with makeup, need a little bit of powder, mascara, lips, and we'll be good to go. And it's pouring rain out, so I'm really unhappy about that because I don't want to have to wash my hair again tomorrow because I have another brand event tomorrow, which is the one that you saw the flowers for earlier, the Paco Rabanne one. So we'll see, we'll see. It's, it's too much planning, so I'm just gonna go with the wind. My skin is really dry today, it's super unfortunate. Um, and it's too late to redo my makeup, so I'm just gonna have to roll with it. I put so much moisturizer on too, but clearly not enough. I needed to put more oil and it, it's, it's pretty much ruined, but I'm just hoping that somehow, some way, I'll still feel okay at the end of this. I'll, I'll have like, it'll have come together. It won't, I can tell you right now. I know when, I know when it's gone off track and then it's like too late to be recovered. And we're there, but still I hope. So, catch you on the flippity. Hi guys, okay, so I am all ready to go to the bowling brand party. This is my outfit. I've got some cute little Mista boots and this Paloma wool skirt. I love it. And then this is a vintage top. I don't know 
what the tag is. I got it on Depop. And a Laura Lombardi necklace and a Charlotte Simone fur coat. I really like this outfit. Very cute. And now I'm gonna go get all sweaty at bowling. So last night was the bowling event. It was super fun. Um, we played like one game. And now tonight is the Paco Rabanne party. And I'm really excited for that. So I'm just now starting to get ready. I did my skincare. I'm about to blow dry my hair. And basically today I played a lot of Animal Crossing. Um, I hadn't used my Switch in like two and a half years. And I was like, you know what? I wanna play Animal Crossing. And now I'm addicted. It's been a few days and it's bad. I ordered like a Sailor Moon case for the Switch. It's so cute. Okay, this is where we're at. I'm gonna leave it here for now while I do my makeup. See how it falls. See what kind of TLC it needs before I go. But if it stayed like this somehow miraculously, I'd be, I'd be happy with this. Okay, I'm in a rush. Nina is downstairs, but this is what I'm wearing to the event. Some cute little by far heels. And this little off-the-shoulder knit Paloma wool set, and a little by far back. Hi guys, okay, so I am signing off for this week's vlog. I've been editing um, the footage. It's literally being edited as we speak um, It's a shorter vlog not much happens But you know, that's just life some weeks I, I was looking at the footage and I really only taped kind of like the fun stuff that was happening, but don't be fooled I was miserable most of that week, but I hope that this 14 minutes or so um, aids to your enjoyment and let me know what you guys want to see next um, I'm always open to like trying out a different video format for YouTube um, whether it's just like outfits or a daily vlog I won't be able to do it every day but just like a vlog in a day rather than in a in a time span of like a couple of weeks or so like this one was um, but yeah I think that's I think that's all and hopefully I will see you a lot sooner than it was in between the last couple of vlogs. <laughs>